welcome to Lisa Marvin Art. I'm going to try to do snake skin cells today, see how that goes. Because um, I wanted to use all my golds and see how they all work together and which one I like the best, so I figured this would be a fun little experiment. Um, for my gold, I'm using TLP, this little piggy. Um, and these are basically all our golds. They have other gold interference mixed with other colors, but this is Harvest Gold, which is their deepest. I know there's paint all over it. Um, and then Ore, which is a little softer, but still super bright. Um, we have Lemon Sorbet, which is a yellow. However, in the light, it's super duper gold. And then I have Ball Gown, which is a gold interference. You can get these at fluidarts.co. So sparkly. I'm also going to be mixing it with titanium white and oh, this is Payne's Gray. I'm not using Payne's Gray. I used carbon black. They look very similar. Um, so, and I'm going to just be doing a swipe and see what happens. So, whoops, whoa, let's get these out of the way and see what kind of fun cells we can make. So, <clears throat> for my base, I'm actually going to be using a white. Um, you could, black would be really nice too, but since I have black in my pouring medium, maybe I'll just smoosh it around more in the background to make those golds pop. This is Sherwin-Williams Color To Go. This is actually their deep base, blue label, so it's thinner. Normally I'd tint it white. This isn't even tinted, but there's still some white in there but this is what it looks like. Okay, so what are we going to do now? So there's like some, is this a blue? No. There's some choices of what you can do with your black. Um, maybe I'll just make a thicker, so what I'm using to swipe by the way is this, um, just cause it's the only thing I have. So I'm wondering, maybe I'll put my cell activator, which by the way, I'm using the Shelly at Recipes Payne's Gray. Um, you can take 15% off the class with my discount code in the description. So I could either pour my cell activator here and schmooze it out, but there's a risk of having a lot of cell activator left, or I can place it on my tool and drag it. Maybe that's what I'll do. Okay, so for the black, I'm going, maybe I'll make it fairly thick so you kind of see it more in the background. All right. And I'm gonna start probably from dark to light. So this is the Harvest Gold. And I'm gonna do a nice, I am using a lot of paint, but I do wanna make sure the paint reaches the edges. Um, and I'll top that off maybe around with the lighter gold, the ore. You know, why not? Aren't these just like so pretty together? Let me get over it. Okay, now I'm gonna top that with a little more black. Now I'm just gonna drizzle the black around it just to give it some depth. So we don't want too much black. We want that gold to pop through. Then I will do the lemon sorbet kind of the same way. Okay, and then I'll do the ball gown. Hopefully this looks nice, right? Just load it up. Right down the middle. Then I'll do the white, but I'll do the same thing where I just kind of drizzle. Oh, my paint's already going over. Lisa, you put too much, saying. That's fine. Just drizzle. Okay, so now I have my cell activator here, and I think, I yes, I'll put it on my tool. One moment, please. Oh, I load it on. It could be easier to put it on the piece, but I wanna have a little more control, I think, about what I'm doing. We'll see if this works. OK. 
okay cool all right of course i didn't you have to really wipe your tool clean and of course i forgot paper towels so i'll just use some paper here okay i'll do the same thing on the other side All right, those are some cool looking cells. And I like what's happening there. So maybe I'll do a smaller swipe just to finish it off, right? Let's see, this one's a little dirty, but I have this, which could work nicely. The middle's kind of yucky. So it's kind of boring, or is it? It could be like a snake shedding its skin. Maybe I won't touch it yet. Okay, so this, I'm gonna continue. There. Is this snake skin or just some cool metallics? We don't know yet. I definitely could have done this on a bigger canvas. I'm just pulling it gently towards me. Okay. And, hmm. I'll do the same thing on the other side. It's too bad, I really like the, I don't love the middle part, but I like the edges. One more swipe and then we'll take a look at what we're doing here. And there's a big black piece there I don't like, which I'll try to fix. Um, what is that black piece? Do I wanna try going over it again? Maybe. Fiddle with it a bit. Let's see. I'll put a little bit of saw activator on it on my little one here. Let's see what happens. Okay, so, yeah, it worked a little bit. Um, so, what is the story here? Well, I like, I like, I'm just gonna start tilting, right? And we'll go back and forth and kind of stretch it out. And then, hmm, I'll go down. I want to make, I'm going to go, I'm going to go slowly because, well, hold on. All right, down a bit. Uh, I mean, it's kind of cool. I don't know if it actually looks like a snake skin, <laughs> but all right, I'm going to get this edge off carefully. There we go. Yeah. I guess, it, and then I'll get this edge off. I guess it kind of looks like a snake skin. Let's go, ooh. Okay, there's still a lot of paint on here. So I'm going to have to, I'll get some more of this edge off. Just kind of play with it. These cells are really big, which is nice. If you like that sort of thing. All right. So now I'm gonna put it back in the middle where I want. Um, I'm liking the top cells. The bottom ones are a little boring. But let's see what happens when I spin, right? So far, so good. Move my paints out of the way. Okay. Yeah, these cells are so huge. There's still some paint left. Um, is it boring just because there's a lot of cells everywhere and this big thing in the middle? Let's see if I move it a bit. Um, yeah, 
I mean, it's kind of cool. Right? I don't know. I don't know what's happening even. All right, well, it's definitely interesting. Um, got really cool, like 3D snake skin cells here. Um, I hope you can see all the sparkle. It's definitely a sparkly one. I, I do enjoy this corner. Um, so there you have it. This is probably look at it this way. So let me know what you think. Um, too similar, too boring. I don't know. Thanks for joining. Bye.